Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today we're continuing our story in this war of mine. Last time we got our first lucky day, let's put it that way. First good dice roll. Maya and Pavle got healed, even if slightly, so that was really nice, it felt really nice. So let's see what comes next. Day 16. These days should be coming the next character that uh, we can recruit. Oh. Someone trying to rob us. They came in force. Maya was wounded, but the attackers didn't steal anything. Okay. Pavle is feeling much better. Okay. Maya is pale. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> well, at least Pavle is feeling a little bit better. Okay. We have food, the rat traps are still working. Let's check the radio real quick. That takes a toll in Pogorin. Sniper fire, mortar shells, cold temperatures are the cause of death in many civilians. The spokesman of the military said, civilian casualties are the result of tragic accidents and criminal activity within the city. The marketplace, we don't have it. Maybe I should try this location, I don't usually put it on. It's where the sniper is, I think. You have two options for this. Sick recovering. Severely ill, slightly wounded, very hungry. Oh my god, she's there. We need to make sure we have enough food for everyone. We have the food. Come on. Maya, hold on. It's in the same area where the sniper is. It's a marketplace, like you have several shops and I think the building where the child is, uh, it's occupied by bandits. Not sure, because I played it super long ago. Oh, hello. I played it like super long ago. I really don't remember, I have to replay it. Okay, one moment. Because this time I'm actually going to spend my resources on Maya. Wow, I have them at least. Oh my god, she, she barely moves. Let's bandage her. When you have... The more negatives you have, the easier it is to get worse, not to get better. So if you don't treat them on time, they will spiral out of control. Come on, I don't have all day. And he'll also say, do you know how risky it was? I almost got shot. Okay. We didn't have time to make some cigarettes for him. That's an issue. What do we need, actually? Carrots. We could use one more if he has it. I'm giving him those because they're useless for medicine. Uh, water. We have a little bit. Wood. Yes, they stole a lot of wood from us. Uh, ammunition. I need ammo. I'm taking all of it. I'll directly take the heaters. You. Okay. Because uh, it's useful for cooking and the uh, stove. Uh, not the stove. The, well, the heater. I don't know how to call it. So let's start giving him cigarettes and let's see if he's gonna be satisfied. I think these are the cheapest things you can give. And I like them a lot because I can min-max how much I can take and how much I can give to make, it, to make it perfectly balanced. So that's one deal. Let's Let me check. I don't think he had weapons. 
And we don't have anything to fix. I would really like one saw blade, but he doesn't have weapon parts. Well, I'm gonna take just resources then. I'm definitely keeping at least two bandages for the garage. Oh, come on. <coughs> so how are you guys doing anyway? Uh, how's the weather? How's the families? Winter is here already, I believe. Even if it's not official calendar. Okay, I'm gonna use these to make more cigarettes for him. Mm, right here where I live, the weather is kind of doing its own thing. Oh, I forgot about these. The weather is doing its own, own thing. Doesn't know if it wants to be cold or warm. So, I wonder what to put on. <laughs> it's very annoying. At least it's not windy or uh, stormy. At least that. I have heard that a few books actually help with the mood. But right now they're overpriced because it's winter. Uh, we can take this, I believe. I'm gonna take the water. I think we can find the wood in other places. And there's not much else we can... We would want. Uh, I don't need the filters. We're not gonna melt snow to make water. We can just buy it. Uh, one of these is gonna be enough. Oh, it's generous now. Okay, one less of these. Okay, in that case, we remove the water. Remove these. Fine, we can have a deal. Okay, then we start adding this. Okay, so it's perfectly balanced that way. I don't think it is balanced because this and this take too many resources to create. But if you say so, I want I want to make cigarettes out of these and their quality. So uh, let's see. Let's exchange these for as many of these. Too damn impressive, eh? Very generous, it won't do. Oops, nope, we need this. How do you guys like the series? I think it's much better that I speak now. My voice is kinda better. The coughing is almost gone. Hmm... Some people want me to put more music or sound effects. But I cannot just forcefully put them. I have to have ideas. Like, I, I have to feel that I want to put this in the video. Not just put it for the sake of having it, you know. Making videos is sort of art. In my, in my personal view. If I just force something to be in the video, it's not gonna feel good. Because I'm not gonna, like... I'm not inspired to do it, I'm just forced to do it. It's not gonna be the same effect. When I get inspiration about something, it really looks good when I do it. At least to me. And this channel is about me, essentially. Whoever likes what I do is here. <laughs> so... I cannot please everybody, so at least let me be happy with what, what I create. And if you guys enjoy it, you're free to come along for the trip. One diamond is costing 10. Wow, the prices. Can I squeeze in a few sugars? I'll take one sugar. <laughs> Alright, mister, have a good day. Try to survive the snipers. Now, let's get to making some cigarettes. How are the traps working? Hmm. These are the most expensive ones. Let's do it. 36 cigarettes. Nine hours. Oh, he's not going to be able to finish today.
Dang it, I could have given him those. But the wood is too expensive, I don't want to. Maybe it's gonna be useful for the garage. Not only to have the... Huh? Oh, you're back. Sad and hungry. Yeah, I know that feeling. <laughs> don't we all? Okay, I guess you want to sleep. You're sick, I get it. Well... Mr. Professor, good mathematician. Make some cigarettes for the... For the economy <laughs> that we have. I am really wondering what's gonna be the... Who's gonna be coming to our shelter. Because our food is good now, but... Unless we find consistent supply of carrots, which is not gonna be happening soon. Uh, I don't think we can support another person. Hopefully it's someone capable. If Bruno comes in, we're good. Because he, he can spare us a little bit of water and wood for the heating. I think it was the heating. <laughs> it has been so long since I played this game actively. I actually checked... It was like, last time I played seriously, you can even check the videos. You can check my Steam account if you want. <coughs> I played it very actively. Like, okay, here's a little bit of story. I probably missed the game by, by a few years. Because I was just graduating uh, from school, I didn't have a reliable job, you know, money tight. Not much experience, jump from one job to another. But the moment I found it, I don't even remember how I found it. It was definitely not from the way I usually find out about games these days. Which is through friends, through Discord, through YouTube. I think I was browsing or it was suggested to me by uh, Steam. You know, because it has this... This game is uh, suggested for you because you played this and that. I don't really remember, but what I remember is that as soon as I installed and tried the game for the first time, I was sunk into it. For one week, like, I, d I remember I didn't have a job at the time, so I had the time to spare. I remember the first week. I was sleeping like four hours a day, late nights, early mornings. Uh, I loved it, and it didn't have, it didn't even have the DLCs that uh, it has today. I literally dived into the game. I love, I liked it so much. Tried all the scenarios. Tried to make custom. I don't even remember. Like, literally, I tried everything for one week. Oh my god, she's... Sheesh. Uh, sleep, you sleep, definitely. S definitely sleep. Pavle, okay. There's still no battlefield city. Battle Royale, let's put it. We're going to the garage, so we need the backpack. I'm putting you on guard duty. Even though you're terrible guard, but at least something. I want her to rest. Garage. We are trading those two. Hmm. I'm gonna take these as substitutes. In case I need a little bit more. Because I really like what I see. Yeah. We don't need anything else. Oh, the crowbar stayed at the sniper junction. I have to get it. Okay, it seems next time I'm going there. I have resources I can replace. I cannot replace it, I think. Okay, then. I'm getting a lot of wood. Uh, so, yeah. This is how I found... Uh, this is how my first week of the game went. Like, really enjoyed it. It was the first kind of such game. Like, you can see it from the side. The buildings are open to you. You can see inside. You have to manage the characters in such ways. That they have uh, feelings, desires, they want to smoke or they want uh, coffee or they want cigarettes. 
really wish they improved on this uh, formula over the years, not just add one or two DLCs, which are mostly stories. Like, heavily scripted stories. I wish I uh, they did more for the base game. I have the meds you need. <gasps> I think I found a reliable source of carrots. <laughs> Well, I'm definitely getting... Oh, you actually have these. You can make a lot of cigarettes from those. You have bullets, good. Let's take the weapon parts. Let's see. Ow. Well, uh, I can deal with those. Without those, to be precise. Okay, the wood is gonna be hell of a expensive. Do we take the bullets or do we take the wood? We are lacking wood. Ow, 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 ow. that's way too expensive. Fine, we can fa we can have a deal, but all of a sudden it's generous. Nah, forget about this. I'm gonna take the the axe and I'm gonna chop some wood in the sniper junction. This is crazy overpriced. Uh, which means I can take these <laughs> and just make more cigarettes for Frank when he comes. Perfect. I'm satisfied, good sir. Wish you a good day, night, whatever. <coughs> Yeah, there's a lot of things I would have hoped that they do, but they never did. Even the mods are kind of limited for this game, but the game is still very, like, I love it. I have never inst uninstalled it from uh, my PC. I always come back to it from time to time, because it just... I like the survival mechanic, like you have uh, these few people and go take over, take uh, take on the world. Try to survive, try to do your best, try to work together. And it's not really about my usual type of games, which are historical or strategy or war. It's completely on the civilian side. Yes, you have shooting, of course. That happens during uh, civil wars, or just wars in general. But it's made in such a way that it's different enough for me, but familiar enough so I can appreciate it. I hope it makes sense, because talking and uh, playing the game is kind of difficult. I don't stream every day or make videos all the time, so yeah. Let's see how our professor and mm, cold days have passed. No, I like winter. I just made the snowman. Well, at least we don't have to waste the... Uh... Oh, that means... That means that uh, the wood and the components are cheaper now uh, as well as the water well okay i guess i guess that uh he's still sick but it says that he was better what's going on here the rebel spokesman informed us that some district might become no dang it We are happy to announce it's getting warmer, the temperature should continue to rise in the upcoming days. This may bring some relief to the citizens of Pogorin. Dang it! <laughs> yeah, she's not wounded, she's, sli she's like sick, and that's it. Man... Uh... <clears throat> The sections of the city are locked. We're screwed. Oh, the two traps caught something. 
This trap, this is the first time this trap works actually. Catches something. This is probably the third time this trap works. I have favorites now. Okay, it seems the weather is not completely fine because 16 degrees, which is perfect, but we have four wood in the in the heater, so you know. Maya. There's nobody else that can do that now. Oh, we have to cook something. Okay. We got a lot of carrots, that's important. I wish I could make all of them right now, because the big soup requires uh, one carrot and one meat. I wish I could dump them in the stove, so that I don't have to worry about them being stolen. But... We'll manage. I hope nobody steals that one carrot. Okay. Now she goes to cook. The guys are resting. Day 17. We're gonna make day 18 as well. Sorry if it if the videos are too long, but then again. 10 meals. Wow, that's gonna be for a while. And that's gonna eat all our water. <laughs> oh yeah, I can I have to make uh I have to make the uh, water filter. I forgot. I forgot how it was called. Ah, uh, yeah. So sorry if the videos are too long, but then again, you can just uh, turn on the setting in YouTube, which remembers uh, where you have uh, stopped watching, and from your browser, you can just make the setting to. Remember your last uh, uh, open tabs when you close the whole thing, the whole browser. And you can just continue watching uh, when you have time. I think it's better to make to take three days because two days feels a little bit short. And not much is happening. Three days feels fine. Let me know what you think in the comment section. <laughs> okay, Maya, you can go take a rest. And let's see. We need saw blade. I'm gonna make two. Hmm. One in reserve. Because I, I know I need one for the sniper junction. I really hope it's not blocked off by the fighting. Because my... Crowbar is there as well. Uh, if I'm correct, uh, gangs are gonna go outside and they're gonna start robbing the place all of uh, all the time. So I'm gonna have to put two guards each night, which means I might need three beds, especially when another person comes in. I mean, let's make it in preemptively. It's not like I have not played this game before. Uh, moonshine still no rainwater collector. Yeah, that's what I meant. Let's make it. Here is fine. And let's make the bed. Sad and sick. I think I'm gonna get books for these guys. This is getting awkward. I have to fix their mood some, some way. Do we have two? We have, okay. Yeah, so this is considered mid game. 
in the mid game you have to start having some kind of economy. For me the easiest is to to have a herbal workshop and just make cigarettes because you make so many of them. You can just throw them at the merchants and they're gonna give you everything. Six hours, wow. <laughs> And they are very easy to trade, so like you can min, min max and make the trades as e as uh, equal as possible. Yes, let's make a bed. I'll put it here. Prefer the beds to be on the floor as well as the heater. One, let's make it two. What do you mean not a good day? We're doing just fine. Apart from Maya being sick all the time. And you. We're out of meds. Yeah, and I, now I remember. <laughs> Lovely. It's almost night. Finish the bed at least. Holy smokes. Thank you. Now you can sleep. Huh? I thought the city would be fighting? I guess not. Alright, we have one guy and one gal, which are both hungry, sick, and sad. And then we have one professor who is just Hungry and sad. Who do we send outside tonight? <laughs> uh, who do we send? That's the question. Oh yeah, I have to go to the hospital. Well, in that case, you guys are sleeping in bed and he's going to be scavenging to the hospital. And I totally forgot to take something. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> ah, okay. We're going to the military base. With luck, they're gonna have some medicine and tomorrow night I can go to the city hospital and just give it to them as, a, as I promised. Dang it. So annoying. Twenty cigarettes. We're gonna take ten just in case. That's a glitch in the game. <laughs> They do have medicine. And water and all the guns I could ever wish. Oh my god, that's a lot of food. Sorry, not interested. Uh, sorry, youngster. I seem to not be having the money or... Yeah. Hee hee hee. Shock, 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 shock. Now, what do we have here? Oh... Oh no, it seems I cannot take the stuff. I'm too... Oh... Somehow... Well, that's a shame, actually. Okay, um... Let's not take the water, because we have the rainwater... Uh... Gatherer uh, thing. We can take these because these are kind of rare right now. 
Shup, 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 shup. I'm an old man. Sorry, sorry. Okay, let's see. Hello, youngster. How about I give you ten cigarettes and you give me one shotgun? Bollocks. <laughs> Youngsters these days. How about one stack of bandages? Oh my. What about all of this ammunition? You drive a hard bargain, young youngster. These are high quality cigarettes, after all. Oh boy. Oh, fine. Yes, yes, I did. Now let me just grab my stuff and leave. As the saying goes, make like a tree and leave. Wow. <laughs> We're leaving just some clean water, pure unadulterated water and some wood. I'll be back. Ta-ta. He's like, what the heck was all of this? Day 18. Let's see what the heck happened. Hello, look at all this stuff. I wish I could bring in so much every night. Oh no. Oh, not again. Uh, none of us were wounded. Uh, didn't steal anything. Well, good thing I took some bullets with me. I'm so tired. I'm going to sleep. Severely ill, what the heck? Why are you ill? Very hungry and sick. Alright, that's it. Everyone get your medicine. I'm tired of this sick thing. You either fix yourselves, or I'm sending you to the hospital with the, the huge bomb that didn't explode yet. In the meantime, I'm going to have a nap. Sad severely, oh, oh boy. <laughs> Maya, hold on. Oh, she's hungry as well, okay. Well, first take your medicine, wait half an hour, and then you can eat. <laughs> Okay, almost half an hour. Alright, Guru, have a go at it. Let's see, how many days was it since Franco? Two days? Okay. Well, she's not tired, so she's working. And we're putting a filter, so... Let's make one. Three... I thought it was four. I don't remember patch notes. But four really felt like too much. Hey, can you help me? Maya, you're currently awake, so go check the door. I'm just looking for shelter. Have heart. Can I stay here with you? I have nowhere to go. Bruno! Okay, this is the guy I was telling you about. He cooks like... Like a professional. Because he is a professional cook. Chef. Can I stay with you? Okay, I won't lie to you. I'm looking for a place to stay until this madness is over. 
Before the war, I was a chef. I even had my own TV program for some time. Now I'm penniless and homeless. If you let me stay, I can cook for all of us. Mm, sure. You don't know how great boy I am. Yeah, well... I guess if you get yourself at home... Oh, you're sick as well. God. At least he's not hungry, or tired, or depressed. Another sick person. What is this? Well, start working on uh, the cigarettes. Hmm, we're gonna need another filter. So if I knew Bruno was coming, I would totally get more sugar. Because he can make moonshine very cheaply. What does this require? Wood. Which we don't have. No. What is this? A spa resort? Get back to work. Alright, I had my nap, now I can just uh, take a seat. Sick on meds, yeah, you're definitely sleeping tonight. How are you doing? Severely ill? Yes, you're sleeping as well. You are gonna be exploring depending on how big your backpack is, because I don't remember. <laughs> He's sick too. Oh, you're right, we're going to the hospital, now I remember. Maybe they can treat him too. Three birds with one knight. Perfect. I'm just gonna wait for the water to gather so that I can put the next filter so that it can be ready tomorrow. It seems the old man is gonna be defending by himself. Okay, that was these cigarettes. Let's make these. Only two. What? Ah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I got freaked out a little bit. Okay, that should be enough for the night. What the hell, man? You don't feel weak at all. You're not even tired or hungry. See these guys? Hungry, sick and sad. You have no excuse. Alright, that should be it for today, let's see what the night brings. I don't ex expect anything from the hospital except maybe treating Bruno, but I think we got most of the stuff that are there without stealing, so yeah. Then, okay that would do. Uh, Anton, you're guarding. Both of you, you are sleeping. Bruno, take one... Uh, bandage, I guess. That's gonna, be, that's gonna be more urgent. And 10 cigarettes. <coughs> Maybe we can trade a little bit with the doctor. I'll take the food as well. We're making a big donation today. What the heck is going on? What? what is going on? I have never seen her run like this or anyone.
Two nurses. Wow. Thank you. Don't you worry. I have medicine in my backpack. I decided to bring it here. Yep, I don't think we have any resource here. That we can gather. Oh, he doesn't take cigarettes. Oh, that's a bummer. He sells them. <laughs> <coughs> okay, good sir. Can we... First of all, here's the medicine. Can I get the books and the sugar for this food? He's happy with it. I hope we get good uh, like morale boost for that. Okay, thank you good sir, doctor, good luck. Now let's explore real quick. Uh, the bomb is still here. <laughs> In case I forgot some pile of resources. Oh, these chairs. I remember them in school. These are so old and classic at the same time. Okay, that section is completely blocked. Smells like there was a secondary attack. I don't remember the hospital being so blown up. have everything. Okay. Everyone's on meds. We have enough food. We have good defenses and I finally found some books which are also gonna boost morale a little bit. That's not gonna be enough sugar to make a lot of moonshine. Probably I don't know, two bottles, but in the future we can at least, when we get more, we can make a good chunk and start selling it. So that's going to be it for t uh, for this video. Wish you a good day. Uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the comment section. Ciao, ciao.